Hi guys, today I want to show you this beauty. It's a Vlad von Karstein, uh, another leader for my vampires. <coughs> I finally received him from uh, eBay. I bought him very cheap, but in a very bad condition, as you can see. Uh, this is the first phase when I show you how it looked before, and then uh, I will show you what I will do with him. So yeah, I have to strip him of uh, all the paint, which is clogged everywhere, as you can see. On the sword is going uh, down the paint. The figure is metal, so I will try with that uh, nail remover, nail polish removal, to see how it's going with that one. The details are still there, but uh, on the some thick paint yeah let me clean it and then uh, i will show you how it look like after so this is how i end up with uh, this vlad von karstein I removed some paint from it, but it was so many layers and so many thick layers that I finally started to see the metal under. The miniature is not in too bad condition, but as you can see on the other part of his face, he still is still some paint. So very hard to remove from these cracks the paint. So beneath the arm there and on the armor is still a lot of clogged paint. This miniature has suffered in his life. <laughs> yeah, finally started to see the metal on it. I still have some work to do to clean it. But yeah, also on the fur coat is still bad. Yeah, I will let you know how it's going again. Hi guys, as you can see I've been starting to work on Vlad von Karstein and then uh, yeah, finally managed to remove all the layers of paint. I think is the this miniature is the best I've seen so far, like the best sculpt. And yeah, I started to with the um, These two colors, a Luftwaffe uniform and a, a green metal mixed together for the first layer of armor, as you can see. And then uh, after I added this one, ultramarine with the with the metal color, and then in in the end I add deep sky blue. With this one for the highlight for the gun for the metal parts uh, the last highlight i put on top of the uh, sword you can see under is like more dark also in the you can see more dark places yeah so i'm thinking the next armor pieces i will do them with either gold Either bronze, but uh, I'm thinking bronze, not to be too shiny, shiny, and like the face a bit pale, to be washed with blue. Also the hair white, I want to do it. Also it has some nice ring on the finger. Then I can do them purple, and also on the sword, there is a precious metal there. So there I will put those ones. Uh, the ghosts on the cloak still need to be washed and highlighted the cloak is almost finished yeah it's kind of finished the cloak maybe i'll just check also so the the ghost things i did them with uh, this thing fall green and then the coat with uh, iraqi sand Washed with Agrax Earthshade. 
So yeah, this is the result. I, I do like how it came out. Also the coach, except there was a ghost, ghostly thing that I'd need to wash them and uh, put some color on them again, highlight them. But yeah, pretty pleased so far with my eBay rescue. Then uh, please guys stay on uh, on this video and uh, you will see the end result. Hi guys, today I want to present you uh, Vlad von Karstein, uh, the best sculpt that I did until now. Uh, as you can see, the progress was a bit hard, but uh, finally managed to to paint it and clean it and did also something to go with it, like a small diorama, like he's casting a spell like an undead is coming from the ground. Um, I was inspired by the painting, by uh, also the game, which uh, is showing that uh, it's having some golden armor on it. I initially, initially I wanted to do bronze armor, but um, decided to stick with the uh, gold, since he's the uh, leader of the von Karstein, and uh, yeah, he had money to have gold. So yeah, finally managed to finish him, one of my vampire leader. Uh, I think I said it three times already, but I think it's the best sculpt that I painted until now. The details are amazing on him. Uh, I went light with the metal on him, not to be too shiny shiny. Uh, yeah, the base uh, did some uh, grass in front, some... Uh, flowers in the back to give a bit of color for the miniature as you can see put a stone on his uh, sword a ruby also some pile of skeletons which one skeleton is rising from the pile as you can see uh, with a shield and his sword in his hand Yeah, what else to say? Let me stop it a bit so you can watch it. Yeah, the the saving of this uh, miniature was uh, nice until I drop it on the floor. <laughs> Thank God, this all the, all this uh, his minion that is coming out is plastic, so it's not gonna break. So yeah. Fantastic uh, sculpt on this von Karstein. Let me show you a bit the minion that is coming out. If you can focus on him a bit. I don't want to focus on him at all. I only like the von, Vlad von Karstein. Remove it so I can see this other guy. Yeah, it's uh, from spares from Grave uh, Guard. I did this one and uh, some uh, skelly heads. I like how it came out. He's coming from the ground, but uh, he is not the main focus of this episode. He is the father of them all, Vlad von Karstein. Yeah, I really enjoy this, sculpt this sculpture and this paint. And yeah, I hope you guys like it. I also put uh, some uh, Insta photos on Instagram, Lucian George 37 if you want to watch them. Uh, maybe the camera is not like... It's not showing like perfect, perfect how it's painted. Uh, now you can see a bit like more how it really looks like. But yeah, I will do some uh, close up photos and put them on uh, Instagram for you guys. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed this project as I did. And then uh, see you on my next project. Bye bye, guys. Thank you for watching.